Hot cakes is another popular dish from the Philippines. This is usually served as a snack instead of a breakfast. This is a bit sweeter than the regular pancakes, but I used to eat this after school. I would just buy this and eat this while walking back home, and I remember the taste. And today I was really craving for this, so I decided to give this a try. I did a few recipe tryout when I make this, and I must say you really need to have a margarine if you want it to capture that taste that you are looking for for authentic Filipino hot cakes. Hi everyone! Thank you so much for watching and welcome back to my channel. My name is Eva. If you are new here, welcome and thank you for hanging out with me. In today's video, I am going to share with you guys one of my easiest Filipino recipes. Hot cakes. This meant to be served hot, obviously. And I used to eat this during school uh, recess for snacks. It's weird because they don't serve this uh, for breakfast. And I wanted to make sure that I make this just the way I remember the taste. So let's go and jump right into the video. For my hot cakes batter, I'm going to start with my evaporated milk, egg, and I'm just going to give this a quick mix. I will also add my vanilla extract and set this aside while I prepare my dry ingredients. For my dry ingredients, I have my all-purpose flour, I'm going to add my sugar, baking powder, and also give this a quick mix. After I mix all of my dry ingredients, I am going to slowly add this into my liquid and I'm just going to continue to do this until I use and mix everything together. As soon as everything is completely mixed, I will add my water and I will also add my food coloring, just a few drops of the yellow and also a few drops of uh, orange and that's going to give you that nice bright orangey color and I'm going to sit this aside while I'll heat up my nonstick pan. I have this on medium heat and you can see that the batter is starting to create that nice little bubbles and that's about the time you want to flip your hot cakes and as soon as you flip it go ahead and add your margarine and you will see that it's starting to melt into your hot cakes such an easy recipe. I was able to finish the whole thing in less than 30 minutes. I'm going to finish this up with some granulated sugar and it's done. If you are going to serve this, you can just stack them up like this and add some butter if you don't have margarine. But I am going to eat this and serve this just the way and I remember. Top. I already did some, uh, I already added it as soon as it came out of the in, but today I'm just gonna add some. I'm going to show you guys how they would serve this uh, at the market. Uh, they will slather some margarine like this. Of course, it needs to be like piping hot. Flip it like this in a sugar. And they would put this in a plastic wrap and this is how they would sell it. And I remember it. So today I'm going to try eat it like that. Right. But I was really craving for this today, so I'm gonna eat it like that. There's no syrup or anything like that. It's literally just margarine and some granulated sugar. Chewy and fluffy. See that? But the taste is exactly the same thing. The margarine. So that is it for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you do, please go ahead and share the recipe and let me know down below if you make it. And thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you again in my next video. Bye!